when pupils are in different classrooms with different designs, does it really make a difference to how fast or how well they learn? And the answer is, it turns out it does. Um, the differences in design of the classrooms explain getting on for 16% of the variation in the learning of the pupils. Um, and this is a big impact if you actually moved a child from the least effective classroom to the most effective classroom. Uh, it sort of impacts about over half the progress they would be expected to make in a year. Um, and they're linked to three broad areas. One area is what we would call naturalness, and that's like the comfort things, things like good daylighting and air quality. The second area is the individualization of the classroom, whether it's a special classroom, whether they can feel it's their own classroom with particular features and their own work on the walls and so on. And the last area is the level of stimulation. Um, whether it's too chaotic or too boring, actually it needs to be somewhere in between. And this is driven by the use of colour and the use of display material. You don't get good or bad schools, you get a lot of variation within any, within any given school. And so you have to be careful to design each classroom to be good. And that applies to when you're designing a school, but also to when you're assessing one and trying to improve it if you're looking at an existing school. Some of the factors are to do with how the school is designed and built, but a lot of them are to do with how the teachers use the classroom, how it's decorated, those sorts of things. So there's a whole load of things that actually can be changed quite quickly and quite easily by teachers once they know that they're important. The results um, are quite academic. We publish them in an academic journal, but we've also created a report called the Clever Classrooms Report, which gives illustrated examples of what's good practice for both designers and teachers. And we really hope that this will make a positive impact in practice. And it's freely available, so please get hold of it and um, see what you can make of the results.